Yeah, that's right. The Prime Minister agreed with his Treasurer's warning. He says, or speaking on radio this morning, that the country's standard of living is at risk if changes are not made to business uh, taxes. He says that we must remain competitive and by doing this, by cutting these taxes, it will ensure that we do. He's planning to present legislation on tax reform and tax cuts for businesses with a turnover of less than $10 million a year to Parliament this year, which resumes in just under two weeks' time. He said it won't be an easy task, that there'll be negotiations ahead, uh, but he believes that some hurdles have already been overcome after securing the support of the Nick Xenophon team. Now, as you mentioned, the Treasurer, Scott Morrison, is in London this week. He's been speaking on a range of issues, including how we can uh, better uh, increase the trade investment between the UK and Australia now that Brexit is taking shape. We understand that the bill to begin Brexit has now been introduced to the House of Commons. Uh, but one of the main issues that the Treasurer is there for, he's trying to seek advice on how to combat Australia's housing affordability crisis, particularly in cities such as Sydney and Melbourne. Labor says there's an easy way to do this, just simply abolish negative gearing. But the Prime Minister rejects this. He says that he won't be making any changes to the taxes. He won't be uh, abolishing negative gearing. He says that the way to combat the housing affordability crisis, to combat that supply, that demand, that pressure that's currently being faced across the country is simply build more homes. The reason housing affordability has deteriorated is simply because demand has been consistently exceeding supply. We are, have not been building enough dwellings. Now, Shadow Infrastructure Minister Anthony Albanese, he says that the coalition is just playing politics, that it should swallow its pride, that tax reform is essential. He even says that a number of Liberal MPs agree with Labor when it comes to changes to negative gearing, including Liberal uh, Sydney-based John Alexander. He says tax reform is essential. They've got this rhetoric simply because Labor came up with a solution. It's about time they put politics aside and got with, the, uh, got with finding a solution. Part of that has to be uh, the tax regime.